Um, all right, my name is Simon Kelly. Uh, I'm the Associate Curator of, of European Painting and Sculpture uh, at the Nelson Atkins Museum. Uh, so basically what I was speaking about today, um, I was looking at the way in which different spaces, um, different exhibition spaces uh, informed um, a perception um, and taking a, a, a real sort of historical context approach. So I, I split the, 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 the talk up into two parts. Uh, the first part was to look at the, um, the example of the exhibition space uh, of the Paris Salon, uh, the principal exhibition for contemporary art uh, in, in France in the, in the 18th and 19th century. Uh, and I showed a, a, an image of, of the Salon uh, in um, 1787. Uh, I looked at the, um, the, the nature of the installation, the density of the hang, uh, the symmetry of the hang, uh, and the way in which that, that installation actually uh, impacted the visual experience. Um, looking at the, uh, at, at the crowd um, and the way in which the density of the hang actually encouraged a more sort of panoramic viewing uh, rather than a close focus on, on individual artworks. Uh, and also the idea of um, uh, viewing as being part of a, a social experience um, and arguably also a, a political and oppositional experience because this, this is happening just before uh, the revolution. Um, so that was, uh, that was the first part um, of, of the talk to, to, to focus on the, the salon, the, the, the salon carry um, as informing um, uh, social experience. And the second part was to sort of uh, balance that by, by looking at um, uh, rather than social, uh, more personal and individual experience. Um, so for that one I showed a, a, a print by Daumier uh, from, from uh, the 1840s. Um, of a collector um, or a, uh, just a, a visitor, uh, looking very closely um, at uh, the picture rather than a, at a picture rather, so rather than, than a panoramic view, which I was just talking about. He gets very close up, uh, detailed uh, view, and that that kind of viewing, uh, I, I argue, is, is also informed by the by changes in installation practice. So instead of these you know, high high walls of paintings hung floor to ceiling, uh, you start to get um, a focus on, and you see this in the, in the Impressionist exhibitions, uh, a focus on uh, uh, paintings hung maybe in two rows, uh, widely spaced, and encouraging a more sort of intimate environment, which in turn uh, I think encourages close looking. Um, and then sort of moving on from that to argue that that, that new uh, installation practice encourages looking at technique, you know, you know, real close looking at the level of finish in, in a work, uh, the level of detail. Uh, and arguably that, that, that contrasts with the, um, the greater focus on, on narrative uh, in, in, in um, earlier um, exhibition settings where you know, works would be hung high and you wouldn't actually have the opportunity to re-engage closely 